What is going on, Mr. Crazy1870? So it's finally official. The new iPhone 5 was announced today. Now, if you have been following all the leaks and all the rumors, then all of this should not be new to you. Now, the new iPhone 5 is called the iPhone 5, uh, and it is made out of glass and aluminum. We do have the two-tone design, and it weighs 112 grams, which is 20% lighter than the 4S, and it's also 18% thinner, so it should feel a difference when we hold it in a hand. Now, it does come with a 4-inch retina display with the res of 1136 by 640. Now, one of the biggest features for me is that it comes with 4G LTE, so it's going to be a lot faster, up to 100 megabytes per second. Now, that all really depends on your service and your area. Now, it also comes with the new A6 chip, which gives the iPhone two times faster CPU and two times faster graphics, so that means that everything should feel a lot snappier and a lot more smooth. Now, battery life, now, according to Apple, you're going to get eight hours of 3G talk time, 3G browsing, and LTE browsing, which I'm not too sure about that one. Uh, we're going to have to see uh, how that all plays out. Uh, you're going to get 10 hours of video, 40 hours of music, and 225 hours of uh, standby time. The camera also got some minor tweaks here and there, really nothing major. We have a 8 megapixel sensor with an f2.4 aperture and a hybrid IR filter. Now, according to the event, it's also going to have the improved low light performance, which I'm really looking forward to that. Uh, but I'm, we're going to have to wait and see how that plays out. I will be testing that out uh, in the full review. Uh, it also has 40% faster photo capture. Uh, and for one last cool feature is that we now have panorama mode. You're also able to take stills while recording video. Now, the front-facing camera now records in 720p, which is super sweet with phase detection. Now, talking about the new dot connector, it is now called Lightning. Uh, I don't know, for some reason, that name, uh, I don't know, it, it just seems weird to me. Uh, it's 80% smaller than the original 30-pin connector, but there is also a Lightning to 30-pin adapter that will let you use your old cable with the new iPhone, but that will set you back 30 bucks, which I'm definitely straight on that. Now, as far as the colors, we do have two colors. We got the white version, which comes with the aluminum bag. Uh, we also have the black color that comes with a black anodized bag. Now, this really all depends on what you like more. Now, as far as the pricing and availability, there is three models to choose from. We got the 16 gig for 199, 32 gig for 299. We also have the Beast, which is the 64 gigabyte that will set you back 399 on a two year contract. Pre orders start this Friday on the 14th, and I believe they start shipping on the 21st. I will be picking up two colors a black and a white so make sure to stay tuned to the channel for the unboxing and full review and all that good stuff so what do you guys think will you guys be picking one up go ahead and let me know what is your favorite feature of the new iphone 5 that is pretty much it for this one hopefully you guys do enjoy this type of video uh make sure to be on the lookout for a recap video of the new ipod touch and the new ipod nano uh don't forget to check out the two latest videos at the end of this video, and I will catch you guys on the next one. Late.